Mr. Zack Snyder, my question for you is, if HBO Max offered you money to do Justice League 2, what would you say? Thank you. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's a very hypothetical. I think that uh, I would say um, I would believe it when I see it and uh, happy to cross that bridge when I uh, see it approaching. So, um, but thank you for the question. Um, but yeah, I think we should enjoy the movie we have. But uh, yes, um, that's my answer. <laughs> Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god, stop fucking lying! What's going on, my beautiful DC brothers and sisters? It's your boy, The Truth 31. Hit like, subscribe for all that DC goodness in the face, neck, and chest. And Zack Snyder today just did an interview with the IGN Fan Fest thing that, that's happening right now. And he basically just talked about everything that's going on with the Snyder Cut and what's to come. For the future and if Zack Snyder is willing to come back to do Just League Part 2 and Part 3 and finish off his masterful epic DC arc and come on and we all know that he's gonna do it <laughs> I mean was there any doubt even after this interview when you watch the interview and if you listen closely Zack Snyder is like really giving you hints like hey wink wink this is happening wink wink if you're paying attention wink wink and some people are still under this denial it's like no 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 this is a one and done it's not gonna happen so dc fans stop asking for it because Zack snyder will not come back and finish off this story arc which but, but again after this interview i'm even more convinced i'm even more convinced that this is happening <laughs> i mean there's very little doubt left and we all know that when a snyder cut is released on march 18th this is gonna be the biggest movie on their streaming platform this is gonna break records i've said this time and time again hbo max will crash because the fandom is hungry the fandom is so passionate and we've been waiting for this our entire lives like we just erased that shitty just league from our memories and Zack snyder's just league is the only just league that's canon like we, we <laughs> like like this is the only Justice League film that ever existed and we and we're waiting for this and we're going to get it. Zack Snyder also uh dropped that you know that, that his film will end on a massive cliffhanger. So again, that's just another, you know, uh, another tease like hey, if you want this story to continue, if you want to see more of this, stream Justice League on HBO Max. Do not pirate it and, and I'm sure you, you guys will not pirate it. But uh, but yeah, I love the fact that Zack Snyder just in his interview alone, just just throwing out little tidbits here and there, you know, trying to hook the fans in, get excited, and his whole uh, and it was trending. Restore the Snyderverse was trending most of the day with over eleven thousand tweets. Again, that just goes to show that hey, we care about this. We want to see this. We want to see more of this. We want you guys at HBO Max, Warner Media, Jason Kalar. To head like, hey, are you seeing this? Hey, we, we want this. <laughs> so I hope you're paying attention. And we want Henry Cavill back as Superman. And like I said, and you can have a Henry Cavill uh, limited series or movie strictly on HBO Max. And if, you, and if you heard that disastrous news yesterday about, you know, a, a black Superman who, who may or may not be Clark Kent, which I'm still like reeling over that. Just like, why would you announce that when the Snyder Cut is almost released? And you're going to introduce a black Superman that's not Henry Cavill on the heels of the release of the Snyder Cut? What the fuck Cut? are you talking about? Like, what are what you guys fuck? smoking, Walter Hamada? Sorry, but we don't want to see Michael B. Jordan, a.k.a. Killmonger, a.k.a. Baby Creed, putting on the cape and, co putting on the cape and underwear. Sorry, not interested. <laughs> I'm not interested. If you want to do that as a separate Elseworld story that has nothing to do with Zack Snyder's multiverse... Or, or, or Zack Snyder's multiverse, or the Flash multiverse, or Zack Snyder's Snyderverse, then, you know, go right ahead. But if, the, if we're continuing the DCEU with Zack Snyder, Henry Cavill is our Superman. Henry Cavill is my Superman. So let's continue that. 
But uh, but yeah, um, great news nonetheless. I'm excited. I'm excited for the future. And this is uh, going to be a great day for DC fans. But anyway, those are my thoughts. Smash the like button, my beautiful DC brothers and sisters. Hit like, su subscribe, and share if you like my DCU content. And uh, what do you think of the interview? Were you excited? Or, or did this interview make you less excited for the future of DC? But if you're like me, I think that this just got you even more excited. And I'm excited to see what Zack Snyder has in store for us for the future. And like I said, DC fans, we are eating good. And as always, love you guys. Take care. Truth out.